some microphones require phantom power to work. Phantom power is also known as 48 volts. So it's when a, a microphone is a bit more sensitive and requires some extra power, either from a battery or from the audio recording device um, to work properly. So the previous microphone we looked at was a dynamic mic and that doesn't require phantom power. But this mic that we've got here is the Audio-Technica rifle mic or shotgun mic as it's sometimes referred to. And this one does um, require phantom power. So you need to switch this on, on the zoom, um, in order for it to work. So make sure you connect the microphone first of all. Then if you go into the menu and you need to go to the in out menu. So scroll to there. And then you have an option here for phantom power where it says in one two phantom. And then where it says on off, select that. And you've got an option to turn it on on both inputs or just one input. I would only switch it on on the input that you actually need it. So make sure that is selected for input number one. Um, if you don't need phantom power on, it's best to keep it off because it does drain the battery quicker. When you have switched phantom power on, if you hit the menu button again a couple of times, three, four times, you eventually come back out to the main recording screen. And if you can see here, we can actually see that we've got a 48 volt in one on the screen. And that just represents the fact that you've got 48 volts of phantom power switched on for this microphone. So now when I hit the number one button, which um, sets it into record mode, we can see the input is coming in. Um, so you just make sure that you set the levels correctly with the dial. And then uh, like with the other microphones, you would just point it at the source, set the levels using the, the dial until you are happy with the levels that you are getting.